for Jackie Dempson. Check it out now. While I watch this selective outrage in rap, all right? I mean, it's always selective outrage, okay? Black Lives Matter, we care about this killing, but that killing, ah, nobody cares that much, okay? Selective outrage has always existed. However, when it comes to rap and rap beef, we're seeing selective outrage right now. Now we have everybody up in arms. We have to hear a response song from Nicki Minaj. Now, I understand why Nicki been popping a lot of shit, and when now confronted and basically punched in the mouth, we want to hear her rap back. Now, again, I have no problem with that. I think she should respond, but it may not be smart to respond, given that she pretty much ain't got shit to rap about, and also, it was so low and personal. I mean, unless she comes back with a hit song, back-to-back-esque type song, she probably will be awarded the L. Now, here's where I actually point out the selective outrage because we hear people, and by the way, Funk Flex for the last couple of days, and by the way, I do fuck with Funk Flex, so there's nothing against him. I'm just really showing what the masses are saying now and how people are selective in requiring certain artists to respond. Like right now, Funk Flex said, yo, just to keep it a buck, Nikki." I know you've sold a lot of records in the past, and we know you're an attractive woman. I ain't a gatekeeper, just a fan of the music. You from Queens. You did try to claim Queen for many years, and I may not be the biggest Drake fan, but he did attend to his business when confronted. Whether he writes or not, you never post pics like this. I get it. Distraction. Love you as an entertainer. Disappointing you as a lyricist, okay? Again, you can see a lot of other people posting similar shit, okay? People are saying that Nikki must respond. They're disappointed in her. And I look around and I'm like, okay, I get it because I'm disappointed too. However, why ain't nobody pressure Drake to respond to Joe Budden like this? I mean, listen, first of all, I'm going to still sit here and maintain Sheetha was lit. Another one was whack, all right? Another one's the second diss track she recorded to me. It's a back-to-back parody, whack. But the first one was lit. Now, Joe Budden dropped like three or four disses back-to-back-to-back-to-back on Drake, right, and he wasn't just reaching for attention, Drake literally dissed him, right, and basically dissed him on I know shopping, but of course, everybody conveniently forgets, ain't nobody trying to, like, point that out, nobody held Drake to the fire, it was like, ah, Drake mentioned his name on stage, like, yo, I should bring that nigga out, fuck it, why is it that we're giving so much credit and merit to Remy Ma's diss song, but we didn't give enough to Joe Budden diss songs, I'm just asking, people, now, maybe it's the fact that Drake had just came off battling Meek Mill and we give him some props because he just was in a war, so maybe you don't force him to go back to war so soon, and Nicki really is untested. So perhaps we want to see Nicki actually put those fists up and fight. Maybe. However, I just can't stand the selective outrage and the hypocrisy because we, again, did not force Drake to respond to Joe Budden after Drake called him out on no shopping. Right? We didn't force Drake to respond, but actually, the outrage for a response song wasn't even comparable to now, and nobody seems to mention it. Again, I'm just pointing out what I see all around the net. Uh, A lot of people are saying they're disappointed, man. Should Nikki respond? Possibly. Will she? I don't know. Again, might not be smart for her career. Unless she come with a hit song, that's a diss song it will be definitely a song she wished she didn't put out, all right? Keep your career moving. Unless you got a hit that this is her, you ain't got time for this, all right? Can you comment, you guys like, do you think there is some type of hypocrisy with people requiring or now demanding that Nicki Minaj respond to Remy Ma? However, nobody required, or it was in the minority, that people were requiring Drake to respond to Joe Budden. Again, both of the people, Drake and Nicki, they could be seen as instigators in terms of calling the other person out first on record, okay? The Make Love record by Nicki, right, called out Remy, and Drake, no shopping, called out Joe. Both of them had this song reply back, but nobody really gave a fuck about uh, trying to have Drake respond to Joe. You let me know. Get a comment. If you guys like them, subscribe to Academics. Just pointing out something here. Just, uh, listen, I-, I hate when I see everybody round with it. Yo, let's rock it. No, come on, man. Are we being completely fair? Or are we just kind of being, like, biased? Get a comment. If you guys like them, subscribe to Academics. I'm up.